Hey everybody, it's Taya, aka Unique Reborn Mom, Unique Acapella, and I didn't think I would be filming this video today, but um, I decided to share this with you. These dolls will be getting a review. Uh, I haven't been making reviews in a long time and stuff due to no Wi-Fi and stuff. And uh, At the time, I didn't have space on my phone, but I got a new phone, and I would like to get into sharing with the world my love for Barbies as well, because it's been a minute, so a lot of people who follow me currently probably don't know that about me a lot. But, you know, you should figure that out by my YouTube name, but I got the Destiny's Child set. I don't know exactly what set this is called. I'll get into it a different time, as this would take a decent amount of time to explain, so I'm just gonna get into it. And I'm kind of holding my hand over the phone because I guess this um, doesn't do a rotate when you take videos. So I'm just going to show you the custom bedroom. Um, I had got the idea from someone on YouTube. I forgot what her name was, but when I remember, I'll tell you guys. And she was just saying a different, like something how you can make stuff for your dolls, which I always knew I haven't done that in a long time, but she illustrated that Dollar Tree was a good place to go, and that is um, where I went to get a lot of the stuff that I use for this craft. Um, I won't show you how I made this craft as it would take a long time, but I probably would do something similar one day if anybody actually likes this stuff and stuff. But yeah, I'd rather get onto it. So this is my custom room for my Beyonce Knowles doll, and she looks exactly like Beyonce. So this is like the wall that I made over here. These are just some paintings, supposed to be artwork. Uh, just some stuff that what I had to make it look kind of cool. This is supposed to be a vanity set with curtains coming down and this is her mirror. And as you can see here, here she has a table with a trophy, like she won some. I put like a fan letter on there. I just started sitting her up today playing with her and that's supposed to be like her notes or she's writing a song. Perfume that won't stay up from my old dream house. And this is her chair that I took from the most recent dream house I think that came out. She got a little compact mirror right here with some makeup, very detailed. And the table has rhinestones all over it. And over here, I made her money tree. It's kind of messed up, but yeah. And then I put like some rocks down here for soil. There's a bee here for Beyonce. And I got these little cheap blowing candles that you could turn off and on that I got from Dollar Tree, which is one of the things the lady had pointed out. You could get a little stuff. Well, you know, be creative and really um, create photography. I'm a collector, but I mainly play with my dolls more than collect, but dolls is a big part of my life as it's something I do with my mother, who is no longer here, and you see they light up and they kind of flicker. I'm going to show you how they look with the lights off, as this is mainly for when the lights are off. I made this little thing out of a piece of paper that came out of an eyelash pack with some rhinestones, and I wrote Beyonce in red, although it looks brown, and I just... uh. Did my famous secret lamination, and it's very shimmery. There's nothing on the back, but yeah, just something for photos and props. And then I made this beautiful rug that I put tool over, and my favorite part over here, well, this is my bountiful calendar, my reborn mommy calendar that I got from my last purchase. And as you can see, you can see some of the things I have coming up for, um, you know, you see Ben's is turning 10 months old. If you could read my handwriting, my old dog, Kansas' birthday is coming up. Kennedy's about to turn two months old and all that good stuff. And these are some artworks I made for the wall. This is a SpongeBob one. This is just random stuff I had. This is another artwork and then other stuff I just had in the house. I'm not going to do too much fiddling because I'm not playing with her right now or anything. I'm just sitting her up and l listening and looking at her and just admiring her. 
and this is the bed I did not make the bed frame itself if you're wondering this is a Barbie dream house bed from the same dream house this chair came from and she has a magazine on her lap because I'm trying to pretend like she's kind of tired but sleeping and if it will focus it's very detailed this is a Bratz magazine yeah you can actually see it music beat free posters inside doesn't really open but you know it's just something to give the illusion the doll is doing something and I chose a specific one because obviously Beyonce is a, a singer songwriter slash artist and she's wearing the Malibu camo comeback shirt as a pajama shirt and I just put some blue scrub Barbie I can be pants on her as pajamas uh you won't can't see everything I'll show a different time without her in the bed because I don't want to move her and I also made this pillow out of a sock and uh, some cloth and some tool and her mattress thing that I made right here is made out of a bottom of a Swiffer mop <laughs> so very cool and if I go into the back of her which you really cannot see her bed has a lot of rhinestones on it all the way in the back so I went all out and her name is even on it but if I move the pillow and stuff you can see that and this is my Beyonce Knowles doll. Again, I do not know what collection she's from. I just got her yesterday. I believe this line was discontinued. I would like to make a doll review because I haven't done it in a while. I want to get back into it as a lot of people are coming out more about liking dolls. And also simply just because they deserve one as there's not many reviews about these dolls. And I'm trying to focus on her face. This phone is so fucking stupid. It won't focus on her face. So you can see that she really looks just like her. It's kind of making me upset. Because I don't know why it's not focusing. It has three cameras on the back of this phone for what? Well, I'm going to take some pictures of her anyway. But for the most part of what you can see of her face... I really would have liked to have saw her face. But I'm going to put up pictures anyway. It doesn't seem to want to focus on the doll's face, so... I'm going to leave her alone. Because I don't know what's happening. It's just got so blurry. All of a sudden. And I know I probably look terrible. Let me just see if I can wipe it out. Nope. It's just this phone. Okay, well, for the most part, we see she's very a beautiful doll. And she's about 12 inches like a normal Barbie. It won't fixate on her face, really. But you can see it has quite a resemblance to Beyonce Knowles. I'll be putting pictures on my page and stuff so everybody will be able to see her. And I'm going to show you how it looks with the lights out real quick. The bedroom is kind of daytime over here right now, and I got Kelly and Michelle as well in this set, but I'll show you guys them another time. And, oh, I knocked over her trophy. This is why I, I recently started playing with my dolls again, and this is kind of why I don't really miss it. I forgot how easy it is to knock over the little accessories. So, for now, I'm just going to leave everything alone. And this is how it looks with the lights out. You can move these little things. Obviously, I move them however I want. And that's how her bedroom looks. This is a full description of the bedroom I created. And I got her dress over here hanging up. This is the original dress she came with. It looks a little homely because there's nobody in there right now. And it fits a very in a sexy manner. And it's a very long dress. It looks like something Beyonce would wear. I'm not sure if she ever did actually wear that outfit though. But this is my Beyonce Knowles doll. And I love her so much. And I really wanted to share her with everybody. I hope you guys like this video. I'm not going to say subscribe, even though it's going on YouTube, too. But, yeah, if you want to subscribe, whatever. I love my new doll, that's all. And I just wanted to share her with the new world. And I have something I really wanted for a while. And I purchased for myself because I felt I deserved it. And I'm very overall satisfied with this lovely, exquisite, very mature-looking doll. So, that's just... and. It's Beyonce's room, so say bye to Beyonce. 
She's gonna go get her some rest. She's tired. As you can see, she's been writing loads of songs and stuff, so she's gonna take a nap. Thank you, and this has been Unique Acapella. Have a wonderful day.